Hi guys, Glory Hunter back with the final expansion of Carcassonne. So this is expansion 10, under the big top. So let's take a look at what is in the box. So obviously our back's box inlay, nice colourful as usual. And there's our back of the box. And the contents. So we're going to get 20 new land tiles, uh, 12 of these are going to be the circus tiles and 8 are going to be the acrobat tiles. We also have 16 uh, animal tokens with various numbers and animals on. As you can see, the higher the numbers, the less there are, except for the number 1. And we have the big top, which is our little circus tent. And we have our six ringmasters. So this is our little ringmaster meeple. Has a little hat on. So how do we play under the big top? So first of all, we're going to talk about the circus tiles. So these are the ones with a big circular portion on there. And these end all features that they're on. So obviously any roads or cities or fields going in, this will end all of them. Now when the first circus piece comes out, you play, you take one of the animal tokens, which are going to be obviously flipped upside down and mixed up. So you take one of them upside down onto the circus and you place the big top on top of it. And then you can place a meeple as normal on any other feature. Obviously no meeple will go on the actual circus tile. Then when a second circus piece will appear, you again will place an animal on the upside down of that and the big top will move. And then you will reveal what was under the previous circus tile there and any meeples that are in the vicinity of it in a eight uh, square round. So much, much like a cloister or a monastery they will score the points of the animal. So if we have two meeples on, they're going to score seven points each. Obviously, if there's another meeple down here, for example, then they're going to score, again, seven each. Or if there's two, two green meeples, he's going to get 14 points. Now, in this case, when these meeples score, you don't take your meeples off. Only if it's a completed feature, for example, that road, you score the road first, take the meeple off and then you will score the points for the animal if that makes sense so that's pretty much the circus and the circus is going to travel around the board obviously creating new animals and scoring plenty of points so you want to be getting your meeples around the circus big top to get your points for that and then at the end of the game when you finish there's the big top will score one final time just before end scoring so that is our big top. Then we'll move on to the acrobat tiles. And these are the tiles with the two kind of rectangular shapes on. And when you place one of these, you can place a meeple as usual on any of the features around it, or you can place your meeple on, it has to be a normal meeple, not the ringmaster, onto one of the squares. And then when you place another tile next to, adjacent to this tile, so anywhere around it, including diagonally, you can place a meeple on that tile or as an acrobat. So even an opponent. So if an opponent places a tile next to it, they can choose to put an acrobat on the next tile. And then on a further turn, when you place another tile next to it, you can build your pyramid. So you'll place a meeple. That's Indy. On top. Creating a little pyramid of people. Now, only meeples can be in the pyramid. In the pyramid, no other um, meeple token, so the big meeple or the builder or the ringmaster, can be in the pyramid. Only usual meeples. So, when your pyramid is complete of three meeples, and it can be three meeples, meeples of any colour, so two greens and a pink we have here, or it can be three different coloured meeples. It really doesn't matter. And when this is completed, all three, you don't score straight away. It will stay until you place a further tile around the acrobats. And then you can choose to collect the points. Even if you don't have a meeple in the uh, pyramid, you can still score the pyramid. Um, so I can place my final token, my final 
tile there, take the points. So I, I will, in this instance, get 10 points. It's five points per meeple. So I will get 10 and my opponent will get five. And at the end of the game, any pyramids that are left, including unfinished ones, so there's, for example, one meeple in the pyramid, they will still score their five points. So it's still worth putting meeples on these for the five points at the end of the game. So a nice little score builder. Then we'll move on to our ringmaster. Now the ringmaster is basically just a meeple. Um, you can use him in all instances of the game, so you can go on any feature, including farms, you can lay him down in the farm. However, when he, the feature is completed that he's on, for example, if he's on a road, and the road gets completed, so for a nice little quick case here, he's on this road, you complete the road, he'll score obviously two points for this road. However, because there's two circus tiles next to him, he will score an additional two points per circus tile, this also counts for acrobat tiles. So if this is the case, it will score two, four, six extra points plus the road. So a nice little builder there for your ringmaster meeple. So an extra two points per circus or acrobat tile that is in the uh, square around him. So again, he is kind of like a monster in himself. So any of the eight tiles around him that have these, you'll get an extra two points for. And that is basically our under the big top rules. So we're going to play a game, let you see it in progress, and we'll catch up with you at the end. Okay, so as usual, we're going to start off with the picking of who goes first. And my opponent will be going first. Every time. <laughs> Pink to start. Yeah. <laughs> Rubbish pink to start with. Start off on the road. Yeah, I'll stay on that side. You go on the road? Okay, I'm going to start off with the city then, I think. Oh, brilliant. There you <laughs> go. One then. place for that to go. Thank you. Okay, we have a circus already. Nice. So we take my big top and the first animal, place it in the middle. Um, I'm going to put it there because that completes your road, kicking you out, but you'll get your three points. And yeah, I'll leave it at that. Yeah. I'm just going to help. Oh, no, actually, I'm not. I was going yeah, to say, build just, a field. just help you with your uh, field attacking thing. And my castle further. I'm going to place that there. Okay, I'm going to make mine even bigger. Oh, nice sorry. big sit here. Okay, so the amazing. circus is going to move. So you place that, usually you complete features first, there's no one on the road. So you're going to take the next animal, yep. put it upside down, move the big top. And then obviously I'm the only meeple in that facility, so I'm going to score five points. So I get five for that, then this animal gets removed from play, and we'll stack him down here. Um, so I, and you um, can obviously still place a meeple on that tile. I'm going to place my big, uh, my ringmaster ring master into the same. That one. Anyway, I'll, <laughs> other ones. <laughs> Getting a nice little city here. Right, I'm going to place that one there. Wow. This is getting there. Uh, Quite big over here. That's ridiculous. Oh, no. <laughs> Never had this many seat tiles in one go. Right, so I'm going to move that one there. And clean the room. Yeah, I need to get some more meeples on the board, I think. Okay, here we are. We have a monastery. Nice monastery. We'll, have, we'll start down here. There we go. Right. <coughs> Nice, so I've joined to them two castles on. Okay, so two men in one second. Mm. Okay, we can actually end 
this one. Let's get her finished. Should try and steal that from her somehow. <laughs> yeah. But no, the pieces I picked up will actually help me, so that's nice in there. Okay. Oh, pop it in there. Can we get on here? Start a road. Oh, it's destroyed already. <laughs> there we go. It's fixed. Fixed it. Oh, wow. Just what we needed. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Straight in there. We'll complete this. What we got? Twenty six points. A little bit ridiculous. All the way around there, look. Right, so I'm going to finish that one. Nice okay. little heart shape. So, two, 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 three, 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 there. Yeah, I'll leave it there for now. Yeah. So. Oh, we've got an acrobat. Uh, I can't find where I want it. Where would you want it? Yeah, put it in there. And obviously, you can put a meeple on either the road, the uh, the farm, or the acrobat. Oh, I'm going to put on the acrobat to show the guys how they work. Yeah. And I've got one as well. <laughs> No, we'll have a let's make a se separate acrobat over here. So I'm gonna put a man on the acrobat, score my road for three. Okay. And another one. Wow. Three in a row. So where can this go? You can obviously there? put it next to that if you want. It's not a problem. Yeah, we'll it would actually else. help me get another man on that one as well, actually, wouldn't it? Yeah. If you place obviously two side by side, you can put a meeple on either acrobat tile, it doesn't matter. Mm. Just bear in mind if you put that one there, there's only two tiles yeah. left to put, Let's put them around into this one. And that might make it easier to get another two on that one then. There we go. Okay, let's end this. Nice. And because I've put it next to this, I can put an acrobat into that tile. Mm -hmm. Complete my city. Two, four, six, eight. I hope my wife should do that there. Yep. Ooh, the road end. So what I'm going to do with this one is put that there because it helps on monastery and I can put a final meeple on the acrobat. So we have our first acrobat pyramid. Place that one there, and I'll take the four for that castle. For this one? Yeah. Okay. So let's put that there. And I am going to put a meeple in and claim them four, not take these yet. I'm going to leave them for a bit longer, and obviously it's helping out on my stream. It's my little road as well. Wow, okay. <laughs> So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. Here we are, a little bit of a road. So, obviously if I put that there, I can take my 15 points and there's a tile left and you can put a meeple back on um, an acrobatic tile that has already been used once it's empty again. You can keep reusing it. But then there's only one space to use it. So it's not really worth it in this instance. However, I could put it on this one and get a man on your acrobat tile. <clears throat> and if, yeah. Yeah. You sure? Yep. Yeah. I'm going to place that there and put an acrobat there as well. Okay, let's get my ringleader on. This is here. Let's get a 
man in the scene. Circus is moving finally. Okay. So, Give me a lot of points, Scotty. Oh, Feel like I've messed myself up a little bit by saying that then. Let's put him there and help put that out. So circus moves. Yeah. Next time. And then, and then we're gonna wow, the big one. So nice. obviously in this square, I've only got one people, so I'm just gonna score my seven. Get my first kill here. So and you have four. So you're gonna get twenty-eight points. Nice. Fifty one. So you get your first fifty time. Right, so Close the gap. Take the that. Yeah, he gets kicked out. Well, that was a bit good, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Most men on the highest numbered animal. That's that was pretty good. It. But the circus is going to move again. Oh, okay. And I'm going to place it next to my meeple, so I've got a good start already. Let's place it this way. So we'll place our animal. The big top will move. And then we're going to score three points. Now, obviously, in its circle, you have two men. I have one, so I get my three. And you get your six. Oh, the same square. And it oh, no. Puts oh, your no. point over. Nice. Right. Monastery with a rogue. Oh, I finished that monastery. So I'll take that okay. off. Okay. So nine for him. Lead wherever lead. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I'm gonna pop this here. And obviously, I can't, if I don't place a meeple, I can take my points, which is what I'm gonna do. If I place a meeple, I couldn't take my points, so I'm not gonna place a meeple. I'm gonna take my 15 points for this stack of acrobats. <laughs> You're in the lead. No, I'm back in the lead, and I still need to get my ringleader on. Right. So, this is the only place to claim that back, isn't it? Yeah, get the last me plant to the It also will complete my monastery. Yeah. Oh, that's all right then. So, you need that. I think so. I won't lose that by. So, I'll take four then, please. Yeah, me plant there, get four. And we have an acrobat tile. Yeah. So I'm going to place it here and get a meeple in there. Okay. Let's try and get <coughs> down there then. Oh, and another acrobat tile to okay. play the one. So, I might put him there. Why not? Yeah, why not? Okay. So that so finishes, your finishes my monastery. For nine. Um, I might, yeah, I'm gonna claim them five. No, not until it's completed. You need to finish the pyramid before you claim the points. <gasps> but you can so put. How do we get them points now? Well, you put your last mine in, and then they're stuck there to the end of the game. Oh, but then we still get the points. You get your points at the end of the game. You still score your five, so you'll get ten points there. So they were lost then. No. Build. Hmm. Yeah. I'm going to try something a bit risky. I'm going to put my ringleader in that city there because there's mm. two things next to him you can get double points for. Nice. I'm also going to use my last meeple to claim that road. Please. Okay. So one, two, three, four. Okay, so that's one end complete. Monastery. Not sure I want one. Let's help this one out. You're not going to claim that one? Um, yeah, I'll take yeah. a risk. <laughs> oh, I've got a corner road. I don't really want that. So, tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to place a farm right I knew you were going <laughs> to. I knew you were. Right. Oh, finally. Yay. So I get me pull back. Nice. Okay. Emma. So you obviously got your ringleader as well in a completed feature. So let's just get rid of him a second. So two, three, four. 
So 14 for your castle, and because he's next to one of them, an extra two points. So 16 points. There we go. This one's going to be a close game. Isn't it, Yorkshire? Yeah, let's check him. Was he on this square or that square? He was on this one. This one. Yeah. So he actually gets this one as well then, doesn't he? Because they're Ooh, around yes, him, so you're actually going to get an extra two points. Nearly missed that. Okay, <clears throat> okay so nice. Let's build onto there. And the circus is moving. Nice. I've got three men around it. Um, where can I plant them there? So I'll take an animal. Yeah, move this big top. Where are you placing uh, your meeple? I'm going to the next field, isn't it? Yeah. Can I just take the two points for that? The four points for the city. Oh, yeah, yeah four points. Sorry. And obviously, I'm going to get five points for three men, so 15 points mm. on there. That's four to four. Oh! That's not a bad score. It's my baby. Is it? Sorry, I'll put that on as well. So nice, there we are. So here we go. So I've completed this feature with my ringmaster in. So I'm gonna get my feature first. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight for that, because of the pennant, and then an extra two for each of them. So twelve points in total. And on a hundred already, as you can see, it's quite a big scoring game with the old big top. Right. Mm -hmm. <coughs> oh, I placed that one into. Yeah. Okay, I'm also going to sorry put a meeple on. On that one. Yeah, okay. into my and I'm gonna acrobat. Take the three road. points for the road. Please. And get you on your hundred. Oh, the exact same piece I just picked up. <laughs> yeah. Piece I want for my. So, okay, so what I'm gonna do is place that there. And put a final meeple in there. Okay. And the same piece again. <laughs> wow. Just a road. So, where's the big top at the minute? Let's go down here then. Oh, yeah. I'll put my ringmaster on that road because he's going to get them two as well. Actually, he's going to get three. It's quite a lot of points there. Get that road finished. Good move because the cat's. Ah, oh, just in time for the circus to move. He's <gasps> moving. So, um, let's move the circus over here. Not want to put it near your men? I'm good. Or even your monsters talk about? Yeah. Yeah, and then put it away from them. Let's just move it next door. Let's just move it next door. He's had that pitch already, look, the whole pitch. There we go, and you're going to get four. Four points. So I'm going to get four, and you're going to get four. So nice. four each. See you. You get your hundred now. How are you in front again? Uh, it's a bit of road, but not the bit of road I want. What else can I start building? What's it from down there? Yeah, and I think. Yeah, I'm going to put a man on that road just to try and get it on that circus. <coughs> So you can use your meeples up quite a lot as well, getting them stuck in features. I'm going to have to use my uh, circus Yeah. Am I building a city? Yes, I am, but not quite where I want it. I've not even got a meeple to put it on, so mm -hmm. that's just... You had loads a minute ago. I know. I should use them all up. 
and the marsh drain. Not oh, great. That's not the place I really wanted that, to be fair. Mm. You can use it to help my marsh drain. Oh no. That little road. Can't even use it anyway, so let's no. get them up there. Okay, the circus is going to move. Alright, where's he moving to? I kind of want him near me, but I don't think I can quite get him near anyone. I suppose I could put it there. No, can't take the points though. No. So we'll place our animal, we're going to move the big top. And six, six points. Nice. So six for me and twelve for you. Yay! And now the tiger comes in. Yep, tiger's gone. Um, and the big top's moved. So you're going. My go. Now I need to finish that round. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted. Get that in there. Oh, Get my meat pull back. 14 points. Believe it or not, the circus is moving again. Oh wow. It is not going to <laughs> so over there. Oh, actually, I might put some of our wings in. Yep. And only me, <laughs> I'm going to get another five points for that bear. Road, that's what we want. It does mean though, I need a straight to finish. Mm, we've used quite a few straights. Yeah, I'm actually going to put it there. Put a the guy in this one. And the circus oh, is moving. Oh, I just thought, <laughs> why did I put it next to the big top? Oh, no. Not far. <laughs> and I'm going to get. Two lots of four, so you're going to get eight points there. Oh, an acrobat. Not had one of them for a little while. In fact, I can now finish this. Oh, and he goes next to my ringmaster. So I get three points for the road. And plus two, four, six, eight points. Because I have eight of those tiles next to him. So an extra eight points there. Might even need another token at this rate. Monastery with a road. Ah, nice. So I finished okay, that so monastery. That's one monastery done. Nine points, please. Everything yet? Yep. Okay. Oh, we've got a circus tile. Why are you moving? Yeah, why do I want to move? Over here, really. <laughs> Let's get him over here. At least one man in there. Okay. Still animal. And what have you got over there? I have three. Just there are three points for that little monkey? Yes. Um, as I put that down, I will also use my ringmaster, but on that road, so I'll get three points for the road. Chris is going to get an extra two for that, mm -hmm. so five points. So now, yeah, I've not got a token, but we have another 50. And the circus is moving again. <laughs> so, oh, I think. I might finish. I don't know, I can't finish all of those. I've got all self for you there. Can I have the circus back over here, please? <laughs> no, we can. I've got two animals, there we go. And and I'm going to score another four points. Okay. You're good? Okay. Nice straight road. I want. Ah, oh, no, I wanted a straight road and I didn't take it. I'm going to finish this city off to give me another city in my farm. So eight points there. Um, you can go there next to that one. It's another circus, is it? Yep. Yeah. So you're going to get three. three points again. Okay, last couple of tiles. I'm going to get not what I want. Um, 
Six over there. Yeah, I think I can get in on that. You coming over there, yeah? Yeah. I'm going to get in on that circus in the city with my ringmaster, so there's an extra oh, two points there, I or see. four points. And I've got an acrobat, so I'm going to get in there on the action as well. Okay, get nice. Okay. Last tile is an acrobat tile, and I've got one man left. Nowhere else really want him. I mean, I could put in there to get my road, but I'm going to get the road points anyway. So. Let's get him there, next mm. to the circus again, and I'm going to have my own acrobat tile. <laughs> oh. So there we are. Nice, pretty quick game to be fair. Yeah, not too bad. Um, it's going to be a lot of points. Like I say, it's quite a high scoring game with the, the big top. Need to remember to bring more of the scoring tiles down. But yeah, we'll score up and see where we are. Mm. So let's get rid of these animal tokens for start. So first of all, the uh, big top scores one last time, so you reveal the last animal of the big top. Four. Four, so I've got two, so I'm going to get eight. And you just have the one meat, so you get another four. And the seal. And the seal is going to come back over here. Then we'll score, uh, I suppose, acrobats. Yeah. Yeah, so I've got 15 here. I've got another five there. Yeah. And another five here. That's five there. And I'll see you get your ten there. Yeah. Put you down to another fifteen. Got another five over there. Another ten there. What else we've got left on the board? You've got one point there. Eight points for my monastery. Eight. And then I've got my ringleader. Okay, we'll do the ringleaders last because they're separate, so I'll get two points for this road. I've got my farm. Should we do the farm last then? I'll do the yeah, ringleader do the first. Farm last. Sorry. So the ringleader, he's going to score two points for the city plus an extra two each for them because they're within there. So an extra six. Exactly on 200 points, so he can come off. Yep. Then yours, you're gonna get one, two, three, four, five for the city, plus you are near three, so an extra six points. So unfortunately, I've already won and I've still got my farm to go, which isn't a massive farm, but some good points still here. So we've got one, two, three. Four cities within there. Three, four points. It's three into three, six, five, twelve. Yeah, twelve. Yeah, that's right. So farm score. So we're going to finish on two hundred and twelve. So like I said, big scoring game, and you're on a hundred and fifty, hundred and eighty-seven. Yeah, nice yeah. big city to start with, and like I say, all these points, you get your ringleader in the in the right spot, you can really build them points up, and I mean, you did have a lot with the elephant over in that first yeah, circus. Yeah, did, did really well. So I was yeah. in the lead for a little bit. <laughs> Thoughts on the circus? I like this one. It's good. I feel like I say every expansion is my <laughs> favourite, but no, I think this one. It's definitely all there, yeah, it's one, of the, one there, of the best, yeah. I would say. Um, yeah, just building the, the pyramids of the meeples and the fact that you can build them together. It's not just one person's pyramid. It can be obviously up to three people in that pyramid. It's it's quite fun. It's nice to see on the board as well and a bit of verticality to the to the board. We played this colours. one with your mum and dad at Christmas. Didn't yeah, they really enjoy really it as well. well with four players. Yeah, and it just worked well with other expansions, which we'll get to in other videos as well. Um, but yeah, really enjoy it. It's, it is a good expansion, like I say, a good multiplier if you're looking for them big scores. Mm -hmm. um, definitely worth checking out, this one. Like I say, it is the latest one currently, uh, number 10. Um, we do have other videos still left to do though, uh, unnumbered expansions, such as the Wheel of Fortune, which will probably be next. So subscribe and stay tuned for them, as well as other videos coming. We'll do some mixture of expansions as well. And, talk about rules for different expansions, how they affect each other, because there are some that affect each other as well. 
And obviously even with this expansion, you're still getting bits on the tiles for other expansions, such as these little vineyards here, which work. So yeah, we'll, we'll discuss them in future videos. But for now, this has been Expansion 10, The Big Top. And uh, hit a like if you've enjoyed, subscribe for future videos, and we'll see you in the next one. If there's anything you're not unclear of, obviously hit us in the comments, and I'll do my best to get back to you. So, bye for now. Bye.